Israel launched a demonstrative strike on Syria and scattered leaflets with threats. Israel attacked a Syrian army outpost without warning and dropped threatening leaflets. After the Russian and Syrian military aviation conducted joint exercises near the Israeli border, it became known that the IDF was dissatisfied with such actions. In this regard, for no apparent reason, a large outpost of the Syrian army in the south of the Arab Republic was put out of action. After the strike was made, leaflets with threatening messages sent to the SAA were scattered here, instructing the Syrian military to stay as far away as possible to avoid consequences. The data on this score is confirmed by the Times of Israel, although it is specified that not aircraft, but tanks, were involved. Israeli tanks fired on an observation post set up by the Syrian military in the demilitarized part of the Golan Heights early Wednesday morning, Syrian sources say. According to several local Syrian sources, the attack destroyed an outpost near the village of Al-Malga in the Qunaitra region. The Israel Defense Forces declined to comment, in line with its policy of not officially recognizing specific strikes in Syria other than those in retaliation for strikes against Israel. After the strike, an Israeli plane dropped leaflets near the border warning Syrian soldiers about the inadmissibility of actions in the demilitarized zone between the two countries, the opposition Syrian radio Huron reported. As we warned you earlier, we will not tolerate any presence of the Syrian army as long as it continues to violate the agreement on the disengagement of forces in the demilitarized zone, the leaflet says, reports the Israeli edition of the Times of Israel. It is noteworthy that during the latest aggression against the SAR, Israel acted jointly with Turkey, although it remains unknown whether this is a coincidence or whether Ankara and Jerusalem cooperated.